When it doesn't work, it doesn't work. If you have missed the first two episodes, I advise you to watch them via the direct links I provide you in the top right corner of your screen, as well as in the description of this video. Well, I'm not going to let the suspense last any longer. I received the power module, but unfortunately, it didn't solve the problem. To make a long story short, the package remained stuck at the customs in Madrid for two weeks. Two weeks later, Mirabel took the old one apart and replaced it with the new one. But unfortunately, that didn't solve the problem. I must admit that it's a big disappointment. I lost a lot of time and actually quite a lot of money since an electronic module like this one cost more than 500 euros on which the Spanish customs charge me another 21% VAT. That's expensive per kilo, isn't it? Well, at least it makes it possible to pinpoint the source of the breakdown even better. Therefore, my next step will be to contact the technicians again. Merci, mes lunettes. One minute, 37 seconds later. Sorry for the interruption. I had forgotten to remove my glasses and I know that with the reflection of the windows, it's not that pleasant. Well, I was saying that as it should be allowed to circulate in Spain again at the end of June. We still have a two good weeks to try and find a solution. One minute, 37 seconds later. Before finishing this video, I would just like to respond to a person who asked me a question by private message. When I say that you have to subscribe to this channel, to receive an email each time I publish a video, you have to understand that it is on YouTube, not on Facebook. And yes, it is free. However, to do that, you need a Google account, which is already the case if you have an email address at gmail.com. If not, you can always create such an address. It's also free and it takes less than a minute. If you also have questions to ask me, please don't hesitate to do so directly on YouTube in the comments area below my videos. Thank you to all of you for your patience, even if obviously I am the first to wish I could give you better news.